Okay, it's 8.49, I'm exhausted, but I wanted to start this vlog. <laughs> so, yes, like I said, it's the 6th of August, it's 8.53, and tomorrow Dewey's Reverse Readathon starts at 6 p.m. my time. I live at, I live in Mountain Standard Time, I live in Colorado, so if... I did it correctly, and by did it correctly, I mean if the internet gave me the correct answer, <laughs> I start at 6 p.m. tomorrow, which is like a perfectly fine time, um, because it gives me all day to do schoolwork and stuff like that. I would like to start a little bit earlier, but 6 p.m. is better than 12 o'clock, all right? Midnight. Midnight time. Anyway, so I wanted to hop on here and tell you guys what I was going to be reading. I already know, I thought I was going to count like the last few, like the last 80 pages of Legacy in for this vlog, but I'm not because I'm going to read those like at 11 tomorrow and don't start the readathon until 6. So, I have one book on here that I'm going to uh, be focusing on and finishing, but I will be starting Everland. I'll probably get around 50 pages into that because my, that's my granny and I's next read. But we'll talk about that later when I actually start it because I'm not like 100% sure. But I'll probably start it on Saturday. So, yeah. But I'm not going to my dad's tomorrow either. So, like, this readathon is, like, perfectly fitting into my plans. I didn't even know this was existing until now. But it exists. It fits perfectly into my plans for this weekend because I don't go to dad's on Friday so it's great but I have one book that I would like to be focusing on for the readathon and that is A Darker Shade of Magic by V.E. Schwab. Now this isn't on my August TBR <laughs> and I've already started it. I'm on page uh, 61 I guess. I'm on page 61 of this and I'm enjoying it so far. I am curious and I do want to continue reading it. I want V. Swab to become a favorite author because everybody loves her and so I would like to like her. But yes, this is going to be my main priority. This is a like, Goodreads says it's 400 pages, but I can never trust Goodreads anymore. This is uh, 398. So yes, I'd like to read this all um, in 24 hours for this vlog. I think I'll be able to read this book in 24 hours, considering the fact that I read Exile, Kingdom of Exiles, in 24 hours, 25, but it was a bigger book, so I think this is a very logical and reasonable goal. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, I just wanted to hop on here and say hello, welcome to the 24-hour readathon vlog. And I'm excited to participate because I never, I don't usually participate because the time zones make the time that these readathons start so ridiculous. And even midnight is ridiculous to start a readathon. What? Why do you think I'm going to stay till midnight? I am a 15 year old person. I have responsibilities like school to go to. I'm not staying up till midnight to start reading at midnight. What the heck? You crazy. But this seems reasonable. 6 p.m. tomorrow I'm starting and... I want to try and read this entire book because I'm intrigued and even though it's not on my TBR, it was calling to me and I'm enjoying it so far. So, yeah. Now, that's all I have to say for right now. I'll see you guys at 6 p.m. tomorrow because I am going to bed. I'm tired. So, yeah. Anyway, let's get on with the vlog. Yeah, this is so weird. Like, transitions are weird. I don't know. I know. Alright guys, so it is 8.07, which is officially two hours <laughs> past my starting time. So, great. Starting off great. Um, so, I don't know if I'm going to count the first two hours. I guess I probably should, because it's not my own readathon. <laughs> you know. But, yeah, it's 8.08 .08 now, and I haven't read anything, but uh, we did fit my grand, did finish Legacy, and we are supposed to read 50 pages of this tonight. So I do need to read to page 42 of this, but I'm not really wanting to. Um, so I'm going to read some of this, and um, 
some of this before I go to bed. So we'll see. We'll see. But anyway, it's hour three, and we're doing great. Sort of not fantastic, aren't we? All right. So it's now hour six, if I'm correct. If I'm not, excuse me, it's late and I'm tired. It's 11.32, and guess how many pages I read in the past three hours and a half? Ten! I read ten. My mom and I got Subway, and then we watched Lucifer, and um, that's all I have to say. I read 10 pages though, at least it's something. See, I'm now on page chapter 4, which is, I can't believe I just did that. Just tried to turn the page with my tongue. Uh, that's page like 75 or something, I don't know. But yeah, I'm tired and I'm going to bed and uh, we didn't start off the first half in 24 hours that well, but maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow. I also didn't read anything of Everlyn, so tomorrow morning, after I go to my dad's house to take care of the dogs, that is what I'm reading. So, good night. I'll see you in the morning. Yeah, this is going to be a weekend vlog because I didn't really read like it was a readathon today. As you can see, I'm loading my Sims game off. Uh, but let's talk about what I did read today. So, I got to page 110, or technically 11, of A Darker Shade of Magic. And it's still pretty good. Uh, you know, the thing that happens right here finally happened. So, I'm scared. But I'm enjoying it so far. So, we have good hopes. And, yeah. And even though I didn't read and finish this today like my plan was, I'm still reading a lot more of this book than I would if I wasn't doing a readathon because I don't really read on the weekends, I kind of just, that's my answer. Um, and then I started Everland by Wendy Spinelli today, my granny and I did. We are on page 42 and we were supposed to reach 82 today. I will read those in the morning before we chat. So yeah, those are what we're reading. Um, this is what I read today, and yeah, with those spines. Anyway, I'm going to go to bed. It's 11.28. 11 11.28. Wow. Yeah. I got to go get ready for bed. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. No, wait. I'm not ending the video. This is a t this is going to be a 48-hour readathon. Haha, <laughs> except I'm not doing a readathon because, well... I don't read during readathons, apparently, so. All right. Oops. All right. So, it is 11.33 a.m. on Sunday. And, ow. Oh, I am debating if I want to start editing this vlog or if I just want to post a video that I filmed multiple, multiple weeks ago, back before the readathon started. There was, it's not multiple, multiple, like, Multiple weeks ago, I want to debate if I want to just upload that on Monday or if I want to start editing this vlog and upload it on Monday. Realistically, the more ex good idea of those two would be to edit this vlog and upload it because it'll be timely, but I'm not 100% sure. But we can talk about what I've read so far this today. Um, this book, we don't want to talk about it. I haven't read anything of it, but Everland, I actually read 40 pages of this, or 40 pages of this of this this morning so now I'm on page 82 and I'm actually enjoying this a lot more than I thought I was going to um this is kind of like a book I got back in 2018 and I got it just because it was like super popular right like a lot of people were talking about it so uh yeah I got it because a lot of people were talking about it I got it at like a secondhand bookstore so it was like and it was in good quality and everything so like yeah but I also got the sequel too, not the third sequel, but the sequel sequel, but I never actually picked it up, and it was kind of hard to get into, I read, so I was going to read some of it for Becca's Bookopolathon, and then I never even participated in Becca's Bookopolathon, so 
yeah, my granny and I are reading this, and I'm glad that we're reading it together because I'm kind of like, it's forcing me to get through 42 pages a day or whatever, and so it's forcing me to read it and feel things about it and actually interact with the story that was just been sitting on my shelf for multiple years. Multiple, multiple years. Uh, but, yeah, so, that is my update. I'm currently looking at my Sims game up, but don't worry because there's literally nothing in my Sims game to do. I wanted to do a school lesson today for math, so I'll look into seeing if I do that. I'm going to turn my fan on like another level because it's hot. I'm hot right now. And uh, yeah, I'm going to debate if I should edit this vlog. I think I'm going to edit this vlog. That's the best option of the two, right? I think it is.